What is up you guys, it is Nadim2001 here and we are back with yet another video, but in today's video it's going to be a little bit different because in this video I am playing Call of Duty World War II officially for the very very first time. It finally released today so I got it as soon as I could and I recorded a video for you guys. However, the beginning of this kind of glitched out so I'm adding new audio to overlay it so it's not as glitchy. I'm just going to send you right into the video right now. And we're just going to explore the world of Call of Duty World War II, whether it be through the menus, through the game modes, through the different challenges that are set in front of us. Made by Sledgehammer, Sledgehammer and Raven, which were the both of the makers from Advanced Warfare. Hoping for the best on this. I've not seen any gameplay or anything like that. I might throw in some zombies at the end. This is very Call, uh, World at War-esque. I'm going to go ahead and join. I'm going to accept all this stuff. Let me adjust all my settings for you guys. I might skip through the settings adjustment. I'm not for sure. Alrighty. So this is what the main screen looks like. We can click on campaign. Um, it'll ask me to do the campaign. I'm not going to do that right now for you guys. Nazi zombies. This is something everyone's been hyped for. Forever, <laughs> ever since it was announced. So we are very, very excited to be jumping into the Nazi zombies. This one is going to be everything you need to know about Nazi zombies in World War II. Ooh, that's creepy. Okay, so we have the option to play online, local play, multiplayer, or campaign. Oh, wait, no. That's just saying multiplayer or campaign. Restart required. There's a new update. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, I actually just updated, so there's no reason for a restart. Anyway, guys, I'll jump right back in as soon as we're done doing the update or whatever. So let's click play online here and see what happens. Do we have to... I hope we have a solo mode because I don't know... I don't want to play online. Like, my dog's in my room, by the way. So if you hear jingling, that's why. This music is kind of loud. I don't know if it's loud for you guys, but it's loud for me. I like the music. It's very kind of creepy. Loading. Welcome to Nazi Zombies. Begin your tale with the prologue and witness the rise of the Final Reich. Play the prologue. I'm going to play the prologue and I might cut it out and link it in the description because I don't know if it'll get me copyrighted. But we're going to play the prologue. So here we go. See you all again. We've had quite a ride together. Back to Scott, the Fuhrer's own stash. Perhaps your finest hour, Captain Jefferson. Anytime I'm taking Nazis down to peg is my finest hour. Besides, these bastards had a Vermeer hanging next to a Valkenberg. Sure, they're both Dutch, but wrong damn century. Olivia. Your field work at Neuschwanstein led us to over 6,000 pieces stolen from private collectors in France. The Nazis have taken so much from us all. This art belongs to the people. And who can forget the Merkur's salt mine? Yeah, yeah, I know what I did, but hold your applause. I'd rather try knobbing a rolling donut before I bust my ass with your pennies again. It's not worth it, mate. Duly noted, which brings us to Middleburg and the current operation. Dr. Fisher? Ten days ago, we received a dossier. Material smuggled out by a young Austrian scientist who's reconsidering his loyalties. In it, he provides the location of a hidden bunker, where Dr. Straub and Colonel Richter have been collecting some peculiar pieces. Whatever they found, it's being used to power some kind of experiment. You have no idea what you're dealing with, do you? Your mission is to seize that relic. Everything else is on a need-to-know basis. Is it just me? Or does it seem that we're a wee bit late to the party? I didn't sign up for this shite. None of us did. But here we are, and you have your mission just as I have mine. To find and rescue the scientist who risked his life to get us this intelligence. Klaus Fischer, my brother. I'm in antiquities, darling. Not search and rescue. Best of luck. <laughs> 
What the hell was that? I told you that's where's Bugger! Austin told you! Yo. I wanted to say quite the prologue, but holy crap. Yo, that took a turn. Oh my god. Okay, so I don't know if it's gonna throw me into a match and just or is it just gonna play me that prologue? It might throw me into a match, honestly. Oh. Oh, it's continuation of the prologue. Oh no, I'm it's first person. Maybe I'm playing, guys. I don't know. <laughs> I'm confused. What what was that thing? I'm definitely in first person. Oh, I'm... Drosten! Olivia! I'm crawling! Jefferson! Ah, I'm stressed. I'm stressed out. Oh, I hear... I'm terrified. Oh. Uh oh. What is this? Close mentioned strange devices. Yo, what just happened? It closed my wounds. Did I just get like Juggernog? I'm confused. Okay. This kind of looks outlasty. Is that a zombie up there? Holy crap. Holy crap. Hold L2 and press R2 for a heavy melee. Oh, oh Jesus! That just gave me a freaking. So Jolts are the currency of zombie Nazi zombies and earned by killing zombies. Holy crap. Ooh, that was terrifying. If that would have been on a freaking like recording, you guys would have been laughing so hard. Like, I mean, wait. Okay, open notebook. The notebook shows your objectives. It also outlines and provides info on important objects. Jesus cry, Minnie. I remember that farmhouse. It's a ghost in place. I've almost made it into town. Okay, so... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. What's my objective? Get inside the farmhouse. Okay, fair enough. It's really dark. More of those broken soldiers. It's weird that the zombies can talk. 750 jolts. So it's, it's, it's still a point system. Uh oh. Oh. I'm honestly terrified. This is extremely outlasty. I know I've already said that, but like, oh, hello. I'm playing in a dark room right now too, so I'm stressed. Oh god, the, it closed behind me. Okay, I need to buy an MP40. The Nazis use this energy from the dead to unlock the arms cache. How efficient. Press right at any time to equip the shovel. Oh, okay. I guess we're playing, guys. My sensitivity is a little bad, so hold up. I need to fix my settings because I didn't I didn't know that was gonna happen. I'm turning that up a lot. Um, audio. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Uh, subtitles are enabled. Controls. I'm probably gonna wait. Where was it at? Oh, how high does it go? 14. Okay, so I'll go on 13. That's a little fast, actually. Sorry, I'm going to keep all of this in, which I know is kind of...
It's still a little fast. They they have it different. You go in eleven. Yeah, that'll work. Oh, hello. Yo, this is stressful. What the hell? Where's that? Blitz machines grant powerful status altering buffs. Uh, automatic self revive. Okay, so it's a quick revive. This is Jug, I'm assuming. Wait, Geist Shield will keep you alive through. Th oh, oh! Okay, so it's armor for 500, so it's, it's literally just a shield, though. <laughs> Where's this last guy? I hear him. It's probably, like, right on the staircase. Or not. I need to kill these creatures to open this door. Wait, two completed. Holy crap, dude. Next wave in one second. They seem to come in waves. More appear with every surge. Oh, Jesus, I, those. Okay, uh, press L1 and R1 to trigger free fire, temporary infinite ammo. Oh, cool. I'm not going to use that. Not right now, anyway. Dude, I'm stressing so bad. I don't know why. I don't... I, this is my first time ever actually playing, like... Oh, God. Go, go, go. Oh, my God. The town is ahead. I hope the others made it. Oh, okay. Is that the prologue? Took me 10 minutes to get through that. Jeez. 36 kills, 21 headshots. Yeah. All right. We did that, guys. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but we did it. I guess that was just kind of like a, hey, if you like that, play zombies. I don't exactly know. Um, maybe. I don't know. Maybe that ties into the campaign or something. I doubt that very much, but after action report. Okay. So this, yeah, there's still the tab system from the beta, which I, it's not a terrible system, but it was definitely not a thing that I liked in the beta. Um, get in the fight, public match. Nazi zombies is best played cooperatively. In public match, you will be automatically matched with a team of other online players. By playing, you will start earning experience and unlocking new features. Custom match. You can also create custom matches to invite up to three other players. You will still earn experience while playing in a custom match. Oh, cool. I didn't know that. And you can replay the prologue, remain... Okay. And then this is my dude. Weapon build kits. Weapon build kits allow you to customize your weapons in Nazi zombies. Changing a weapons kit will change its appearance and configuration when equipped as a starting weapon or when purchasing it from weapon lockers or the mystery box. So the mystery box is still relevant, guys. Pistol. Interesting. So these are all the weapons, I guess, and... In World War Two, I'm almost gonna venture to say that these were all available. These are what are they called? These were all available in a. Uh... Ooh, different camos. Sorry, these are the first looks at our at our camos here. That kind of looks cool. awesome anyway sorry um this is our first look at all the camos and stuff but i'm almost gonna venture to say that all of these guns were originally available in the beta raven research unlocks at level five consumables consumables are one use items that provide discounts spawn power-ups or temporarily grant powerful weapons among other things what is that equip your consumables here Consumables are used when activated. Rare consumables can be used more than once. 
uh, self revives can be used to pick yourself up from last stand up to two times per match. No need to equip self equip self revives; they're automatically equipped. So are these gobble gums basically? Double points, insta kill, max ammo. Spawn a full meter power up to overcharge each player's special ability meter. Interesting. Nuke. Uh, guarantees the next weapon that will be assembled by the mystery, mystery box. Pro or provides a 50% discount on any Blitz machine purchase. Provides a 25% refund on any jolt purchase. Equip an M1 bazooka for a short, for a short time. Equip a flamethrower for a short time. Huh. Pretty cool. I kind of like that. They'll see how. Calling cards. Here's some of the calling cards. These are just standard issue. I like that one right there. Uh, let me. Yeah, these are all locked ones, I'm assuming. I'm, I'm hoping they don't have like a supply drop thing. I'm pretty sure they do, actually, now that. Now I'm thinking about it because these are all these are all locked and stuff, but here's the emblems. And I can create my own and stuff. Clan tag, let me go with my old classic clan tag from like Modern Warfare 3. I can prestige in this. Recordings. Oh, okay, so we have 26. There's an end game theater. That's really, really cool. Uh, social, yeah, we don't care about that. Settings. Uh, well, I already did all of the all of that store. There's nothing in the store except for the season pass. Uh, news. We'll let you know when there's new content. Blah blah blah. Same old, same old. Let me. Look, Nazi. Would you like to exit the lobby and return to the Nazi zombies menu? No, I don't. Um, okay, so interesting. Let me jump into a custom match. Map: The Final Reich, the sleepy mining town of Middleburg, where shadowy horror stirs. Game rules. Join in progress, not allowed. Okay, it's literally just me. Oh, I can select my character. I, I don't know who, what characters are what, but... What was this character? Oh, I want to be him, definitely. Okay, so... Um, yeah, let me... Am I ready? How do I ready up? Oh, ready up right there. Boom. Okay. So we get to choose what we're gonna be. Sorry, let me readjust my position here. I'm not even gonna cut that out because I don't really, I want you guys to get the full effect. <laughs> anyway, so we get to adjust what we want to be. We can be free fire, um, squad tactics fully loaded stubborn. The player can fire their weapon without expending any ammo even if the clip is empty. What? Creates a burst originating from, originating from the player, knocks back a nearby enemy, applies light damage and holds them stunned. Nearby zombies chase the user. Uh, the triggering or the triggering player deals double damage to zombies for the duration of the special. The player is ignored by zombies. I'm gonna go offense, and we're just gonna start the match. There you go. Next match in eight seconds. I'm excited. Supply drops. I literally give me one second. Bottom right, R2 supply drops. We're gonna check this out. Rare zombie supply drop. Supply drop. Okay, they're all okay. I don't, I don't know what the point. Okay, whatever. We're gonna go ahead and start of it. Or start it up. I don't know what the point of that was because it didn't even give me an option for like, uh, crypto keys, whatever they're called. I don't know what they would be called in this, but it didn't give me the option to even, like, spend them or even cod points for that matter. I don't exactly know. That's a cool picture. I like that. The shield will protect you from a fatal blow, but must be purchased once it is exhausted. So that's going to be a new feature. Every time the shield breaks, you have to buy for 500, I believe it was. I'm not for sure on that. That's interesting. The zombie has, like, blonde hair. And it kind of looks like it was sewed on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is weird. Oh, this is weird. Quiet is good. Let's hope it stays that way. Nothing to retrieve. The freak does that mean? Oh, God. Okay, this is the starting room, guys. What, is that quick revive? It is quick revive. Okay, this gun is extremely powerful for like no reason. Oh, he dropped a nuke. What was that little shaking for? Zombie supply drop. Oh, so you just get the supply drops. It's not like you, you don't buy them. 
Okay, let me grab the nuke. So the M1911 is, or 1911, sorry, is extreme. Oh, there's there's little spaces in between waves. That's really cool. Anyway, the 1911 is very powerful for whatever reason. Oh. You bought lin Libin Blights. I don't know. I'm gonna butcher all the names. That's just quick revive. Be fire ready. Do I have a red dot? Oh, for a second it looked like I had a red dot. Ooh, what is this? Sentry gun? If I fill the tank with gas, I can blow open the grates. But that's a hint to Easter egg. Or maybe it's just part of the map, I don't know for sure. What is that? Oh, it's a max ammo, I think. Oh, melee sucks in this, I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of irritated. What is that? Whoa, 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 whoa! I don't think I was supposed to shoot that. That was terrifying. Wave three. Okay. What's over this way? Uh, it looks like a, a, yeah, it's not what I thought it was at all. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna sound like I knew what I was talking about, but that was not at all what I thought it was. Melee is really slow. That's really upsetting. Oh, there's a lot of drops. What even is that? Double points? Getting kind of low and health here, and I'm starting to panic. I can't even melee because it's slow. Oh, there's a- I forgot there was a dolphin knife. I just tried to slide. Ooh. I just realized that there's a lot of ammo in this weapon. Trying to use it all is basically pointless. Earthquake! What does that mean? Is it like genuinely an earthquake or what happened? I'm gonna kill off one of you. I'm gonna leave the other, but he always oh, turns into a runner. I don't like that. Um. Oh! I'm irritated. Why did that just happen? Okay, so this is that's the shield, and this is just to screw me over. Oh no, it goes up here. Hopefully, I don't get trapped. Looks like we found Santa's workshop. I don't know what that means. Oh, okay. Interesting. Um, what's back here? Dude is making the funniest noises. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, okay, I'll have that. To find a way to pop the caps off of these buggers. So I need down there to get the. Or I need down there. But in order to get down there, I have to turn on the power. So I have to find the power switch or the power room. I'm not gonna lie. I'm doing much better on this than I did on my first Infinite Warfare run. I'll tell you that. <laughs> if you guys have uh, have seen that. You'll know. Oh, I just broke something and I didn't mean to. Uh, okay, so this map is interesting. How much is what is this door up here? How much is it? These gates are wild. Oh. They need power to open. Okay, well everything beyond this point requires power, so I'm assuming the power is directly in that area. Oh at the top right it says where I am. That's pretty interesting. A generator. Oh. Oh, the generator is in there. 
if I have to fall in there, I doubt it, but what if I did? Maybe... Maybe I'm supposed to go up here? Let's figure something out. Okay, that did not work. Hmm. Um. I'm a little stuck, guys. I'm a little stuck. Does this require power? I'm gonna say it does. Yes, it does. It's this way. Oh, that zombie. Oh, this is the beginning of this room. Okay. Well, not room. You guys get me when I say that. Where is the power? Okay, well, the gas in the generator. Maybe that's what it was. So this goes this way. And it leads to right here. To turn the valve. There you go. I figured it out. Sorry. I'm an idiot. I remember he said that earlier on, and I totally spaced it. Okay, that goes up. But also doesn't help me at all, because I have no idea where it goes after that. I swear I've, saw, I've seen one over here. Can I open this? That is a door that I can't open. Will I open it? More than likely not. Okay, here's that wire again. Oh, I just passed it, right? Uh... Interesting. This is pretty cool, guys. I actually like this a lot. Except for my hand looks gigantic holding this weapon. <laughs> okay, so I need to go to the third one. Which is this way. Literally right there. Oh! I have to... That's irritating. Tank. That's really irritating. I did not know you had to do that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dang, okay. This is gonna be really, really tough. Gotta figure out where that other one was. Oh, it was right here, wasn't it? Hopefully I don't get wrecked. No! I thought it was done. <sighs> Irritated. It's kind of cool that some of the map is like interactable. I might just have to kill this guy, honestly. I don't know who I'm kidding. Still has 57 bullets left, so... Gas is pumping, but we might need more. Yeah, we just need one more. I don't even remember where that one is. This way? Wave four. I don't want to buy that gun. I was thinking about it, but then I decided against it. I'm going to buy this just because I freaking Ooh, can. Fancy. What is that? Full meter. Bloody hell! What does that mean? Why am I screaming? I don't know why I'm screaming like that. Why is David Tennant screaming, guys? And why is there intense music playing? It's just like a normal zombie round, is it not? Or is this kind of like a weird dog round mix? I don't, I don't understand the significance. What's special about this round? Oh no, this was a bad gun choice. Really not that good. That'll work. Thank you, my man. Oh, the other one's right there. I'm an idiot. Oh, 
crap. Come on. I'm already on like wave six now, I think. Or wave five, yeah. Okay. Power rolling. Activate the pilot light. What does that mean? How do I do that? What's the pilot light? Um, restore power to the bunker door. That's my main objective, but... Oh, there's flies. Whoa, what are you? Oh yeah, this is definitely the equivalent to a dog round. I don't know what happens if these guys touch me, so I'm, not, I'm very nervous. Whoa! Oh, max ammo. Fair enough. Okay, so... Oh! Oh! Yo! Yo! Okay. Now what am I supposed to do? Restore power to the bunker door? They won't stay down. Dead means dead, you gobshites! Me. Oh. The screaming makes me think that it's a special round, but I know for a fact that it isn't. Because we just literally just had the special round. Unless there's like a weird multiple. Do I have to jump down there? If I have to jump down there, I'm gonna get so angry. If I have to jump down there, I need to buy a better weapon. That's that's the the whole thing, homie. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's one of those guys. So are those guys just like reoccurring like each round? Like it doesn't matter what you do, you're gonna see one. literally the gun I have. Hmm. I don't know what I'm... Restore power to the bunker door. Do I jump down? Do I jump down? Oh. I didn't mean to. Requires power. This is Jug, right? Wait, that's an increased sprint. I'm not going to actually even look at that. Uh. There you go. Oh, okay. Oh god. That was annoying. Okay, command room. I can actually buy that now. So that's exactly what I'm going to do cuz that looks like the most important door. Explore the bunker. Here we go. That looks like it's important. It's probably not, but it looks like it is. Ooh. Hello. Find the salt mines door. <coughs> Sorry. Looks like we'll need to reroute the power to get through. I don't know how to do that. Not active. Grease gun. A station for building guns? How nice! It's a regular ballistic buffet! I love his voice. Such a good voice. What is this? Increased melee damage. Interesting. Okay. So we have to reroute the power. Weren't there two of them? I could have sworn there was two of them. Whatever. Um. Oh my god. I hope this isn't Zetsubonoshima 2.0. Oh, this is this was in the trailer. That's a trap. What is that? 
Ooh, that would be good to have. Not gonna worry about it until I absolutely need it, though. Is that a workstation? Oh, I don't know what I did. I picked up something. Yo, what is going on? What's with the music? Insufficient power. I don't know how to reroute it. Oh, he just got put down. Um. Try to reroute the power for access, but I don't flip and know how, dude. Missing parts. Not active. Oh, hi. Not active. Reroute for access. Find the power supply for the. M what the freak? Oh, there's the mystery box. That's what it looks like. I didn't know that's what that was. I got a Type 100. That's actually a really good gun. This was one of my favorites while we were playing. Oh, that's the morgue. I can open that one, but I can't open this one for whatever freaking stupid reason. Let's go ahead and do it. Oh my god. You are one sick puppy. STG. And I sick. Bunch of stuff. I just rerouted power. One more to go. Oh, okay, so I just have to do that again in the other room. Bar. I'm looking at everything very quickly just because, like, I don't know where I am. Well, that's a door I'm not going to be able to open. Oh, that's a trap, I think. Uh, armor. I'm almost thinking the armor is going to be worth it, guys. I'm not for sure. Okay, so let me go back here into this room. And I, I know what I'm looking for now. I just need to look for one of those control panel things. Yeah, that one's insufficient as well. Uh... I don't know what that noise is. But I'm terrified on the oh, lowest Christ, key. On I've got to run like a vicar in a whorehouse. Oh, okay. So there's that one right there. So now I know it's on a timer, that's fine. I don't even remember where the second one is, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. It was, uh, I think it was this way. I hope to God. Oh no. I, I don't know. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I think we can get through now. Open the salt mine door. Enter the whoa! It's for the salt mine. What is that? There you go. I accidentally killed off my final zombie, but it was worth it. Did anybody else notice the medieval artifact floating in the bloody fucking air? Looks like the hilt of a sword. Uh oh. Fudge! I don't know what I just did. I'm gonna assume everything I did was not good. Ah, the thing sucks down zombie juice, Jesus! Oh! Alright, dope. Just need to start a train and then it's a soul box. Bloody hell! What? Oh, there's a lot of them. Yeah, I'm dead. 
Oh, maybe not. Do they have to be in the circle? This is obnoxious. It's actually really not that obnoxious, I'm just being picky. I'm gonna venture to say that they have to be in the circle. Oh, I got trapped for a second. I don't know what I did. What, did it just disappear? What? Looks like someone put a jimmy hat on the claw, that's no fun! Unlock the device canopy. Freak, does that mean? Unlock the device canopy. What is this? FG. Okay. Unlock the device canopy. Oh wait, that? Not active, no. I, I'm not sure what the device canopy is, guys. <clears throat> Unlock the device canopy. Yeah, I read that right. I'm gonna buy this. Unlock the device canopy. Wait, that? Is it this right here? Maybe. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh God. Basically what you're telling me is I literally can't do that unless it's between rounds. There you go. I'm gonna go buy a better weapon than this. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fancy. What's fancy? It got dark. Shit. What am, what am I? Start weapon assembly process. Oh, so okay, that right there. Missing parts. I can't. I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not. Whoa, what are you? Oh. Kind of annoying that there's only 20 bullets in this clip. Whoa, hello. Okay, this final. What is, is it? Do I need to get this? Still not active. Start weapon assembly process. Oh. Escort that transfer device. The freak does that mean? What transfer device? Oh, I have to follow it. Okay, fair enough. Where's it taking me? What? 
Oh, do I have to kill zombies in this circle? Yes. The answer is yes. I don't know if that's going to bode well for us guys. <clears throat> SV team. Can't do. Can't do it. I can't go, as they say. I might have to use my free fire effect. Wave 9. Oh, you fuck all. Done doing what it's doing. Wait, what's that? Why is it flashing? What's it doing? Pick up the Tesla gun barrel. What is that? Oh, oh, he's a sprinter. Did I kill him? Nice. This looks like some sort of weapon, but it's missing some parts. But it's missing some parts. Faster reload speed. I'm gonna honestly need that, so yeah, let me grab it. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. That's gonna be the death of me. At some point or another. Okay. Whoo! Oh my god, okay, sorry. Do I need to do anything else? Well, yeah, but at least I placed the other one. I scored the transfer device again. kills it needs hopefully not too much this is my first playthrough and I think I'm doing pretty well honestly that's really oh no it's one of these stupid rounds the really fast guys oh. Okay, I'm gone. Oh, okay, it's moving, it's moving. It's working out, because everything, everything's working. There you go, perfect. Wait. Oh, I already have it, okay, I was like, what's that noise? going on someone's glitch that'll 
Those make everything easy for me. There you go. It's basically done. What is this? Buy ammo. Oh, okay. I don't even need ammo. I just got a max ammo, but... these bad guys again. I forgot he was going to sprint at me. Oh! That was terrifying. Okay, he's dead. So, I created an active guys trap circuit undead body of a soldier and simple commands will trigger the lizard's brain. So this place with the other past is not what tender. Yes, I'll follow that thing to the station. What is that? 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 Oh my god! I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, ah! Oh, what? Okay, I survived somehow for a second. I was gonna say, where's the big bad? But there he is right there. I don't wanna die, leave me be. I don't know how to kill this guy. Oh, I'm dead for sure. Oh, no, I'm not. Somehow, I don't understand. I killed myself. Jesus. I use it. Okay, I have a self-revive, I guess. It's pretty cool. Okay, where did this guy go? Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Like a grenade gun. Jesus. Oh my god. Screw it. There you go. What is that? Insta kill? I don't need it. Oh, I, okay. I picked up his head. I, what am I? Yes, I picked up his head. What do I do with it? I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the head. Anyway, um, to assemble the Tesla gun, let me. Activate power grid? Yo! A real weapon. This is a map of the power grid. I just need to adjust these circuit boxes to match with here. I don't know what to do with this thing. Why are, they, why are they called Brenner heads? That's freaking weird. Did I just spawn one of those guys? Uh oh. 
Oh, you can share stuff. That's freaking cool. Okay, I, uh, I really don't know what to do with that. My panic button. Yeah, I'm dead. God! God, no! Ugh. Dang it. Well, <laughs> wow. Okay, so we're gonna see exactly the aftermath when you end a game, what happens. I got, got me four levels. I got 257 kills. I think I got a pr pretty decent amount of stuff done. I don't know how long, like, the main stuff, like, the main setup is, but... I feel like I got pretty set up. I didn't know what to do with that head. The map was really nice. I did like the map. I got two unlocks. What is that even? Okay, I got... I got the supply drop and a quick draw attachment. Okay, interesting. So let me look at my supply drop. Okay. There you go. Let me see what I get. Good night, kiss, grip. Uh... Ooh, okay. That's cool. So you get two two thingies for a uh... Oops, sorry. I'm trying to figure out how to do this. Oh, personalize. Well, no. Okay, there you go, like that. So yeah, there you go. Interesting. Ooh. Okay, guys. That was really, really fun, actually. I'm definitely going to be playing some more of this in the future. I'm also going to be doing a campaign series as well. I'm very, very excited for this. You guys have no idea. This is freaking cool. That was really fun. Uh... But yeah, I do hope that you guys enjoyed that. Make sure you leave a like on the video and in the comments below. Let me know, do you guys like this type of zombies? Do you think that this is a good spin on the zombies mode? Because a lot of people did not like Infinite Warfare Zombies due to its kind of cartoony type style. But this has a very serious and kind of scary feel to it. So I do like this a lot. However, I don't believe that it is in the same type of uh, category as Treyarch. Because Treyarch did theirs solely based on like a non... It was a scary storyline. It was more of like an intellectual type story. Whereas this is probably going to go with a horror type story. So I... You can definitely compare them because Treyarch did it first. But I would not recommend comparing them because they are their own separate entities and should be treated as such. But make sure you guys subscribe to the channel because I will be posting more of World War II, whether it be the campaign, the multiplayer, or more of the zombies. But I will post more for sure. So uh, make sure you subscribe because I post every single day except for Fridays and Sundays. However, I did not post this last Thursday, so I am posting this video on a Sunday due to the fact that I did not post on a Thursday. So it will kind of balance out I suppose but I will let you guys go have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you in the next video goodbye <laughs>